The awards and achievements are a very important category for your exams. In this video, we'll be looking at the major awards and achievements which was in the news in the past few months. India's Harna Santhu won the Miss Universe 2021 title. She became the third Indian to win this title. She was crowned by previous Miss Universe title holder Andrea Mesa from Mexico. Paraguay's Nadia Ferreira is the first runner-up while South Africa's Leila Swane became the second runner-up. South Indian actor Rajini Gandh was conferred with 51st Dada Sahib Palke Award for his contribution to the Indian cinema. The award was presented by Vice President M. Venkaya Naidu at the 67th National Film Awards for his contribution as an actor and producer. Indian mathematician Neena Gupta has received the 2021 Ramanujan Prize for Young Mathematician from Developing Countries for her outstanding work in affine algebraic geometry and cumulative algebra. She is a professor at the Statistics and Mathematics Unit of Indian Statistical Institute, Kolkata. Indian architect Balakrishna Doshi wins Royal Gold Medal 2022. It is given in recognition of a lifetime work. The Royal Gold Medal is approved personally by Queen Elizabeth II and is given to a person or a group of people who have had a significant influence on advancement of architecture. South African playwright and novelist Damon Galgut has won the 2021 Booker Prize for The Promise, his third shortlisted novel. He was previously shortlisted in 2003 and 2010 for the Booker Prize. Assamese poet Nilmani Pukan Jr. won the 56th Nyanpeed Award and Konkani novelist Damodar Maso won the Sahitya Academy Award in 1983 for his novel Karmali. Nilmani Pukan was awarded the Patma in 1990 and received the Sahitya Academy Fellowship in 2002. The Nobel Prizes are awarded to those who during the preceding year have conferred the greatest benefit to mankind. The 2021 Nobel Prize was announced by Norwegian Nobel Committee for various categories. Nobel Prize in Physiology 2021 was awarded jointly to David Julius and Adam Petaputin for the discoveries of receptors for temperature and touch. Sekiro Manabe, Klaus Hasselmann, Giorgio Parisi jointly won the 2021 Nobel Prize in Physics for groundbreaking contributions to our understanding of Earth's climate and other complex physical systems. The Nobel Prize in Chemistry was awarded jointly to Benjamin List and David W. C. Macmillan for the development of asymmetric organocatalysis. The Nobel Prize in Literature was awarded to Abdul Raza Gurna for his work showing the effects of colonialism and fate of refugees in the gulf between cultures and continents. The 2021 Nobel Peace Prize was awarded to Maria Rasa and Dimitri Murato for their efforts to safeguard freedom of expression. Professor Eric K. Hanushik and Dr. Rukmini Banerjee have been awarded the 2021 Yidan Prize for Education Development for Improving Learning Outcomes in School at a Scale. Yidan Prize is the world's highest education accolade. The Government of India has declared the Patma Awards 2021. These highest civilian honours of India are usually announced annually on the eve of Independence Day. In 2021, many exponents from art and culture were also awarded with these honours. Let's have a look at them. Sudarshan Sahu, an Indian sculpture artist from Puri in Odisha was awarded Patma Bhushan this year. Sahu established Sudarshan Craft Museum Puri in 1977 and Sudarshan Art and Craft Village, Bhuvaneswar in 1991. He created beautiful carvings of the Jadaga tail set, Dauli Peace Pagoda in 1971, which earned him worldwide recognition and appreciation. Subbu Armukham Vilpattu Theatre Art Exponent was awarded Patma Sri this year. Vilpattu or Villadicham Pattu is the ancient form of musical storytelling in India where narration is interspersed with music. Here the performers narrate the stories after striking the bow. Veteran Assamese folk musician from Majuli, Sri Gobiram Bargayan Burabak was conferred with Patmasri this year. 
he is known for grooming the satriya traditional music for over 7 decades satriya nritya is a indian classical dance drama with the origins in the vaishnavite monasteries of assam and is attributed to the 15th century bhakti movement scholar and saint mahapurish srimanta shankarthi dulari devi an artist working in the mithila art was awarded padma shri this year mithila painting is a style of indian painting practiced in the mithila region of bihar themes of this folk paintings include nature and mythological events sri parshuram atmaram gangavane a folk artist from sindhudurgan maharashtra was awarded padma shri this year he is famous for preserving 500 year old art of chitragadi storytelling chitragadi represents a special art form of maharashtra having the tradition of combining oral narrative of telling tales along with images shown simultaneously with hand painted pictures kannada theatre actress manjama jodi was awarded the padma shri this year her unique gesture while receiving the awards went viral in social media in 2019 she became the first trans woman to be the president of karnataka jarawad academy state's top institution for folk arts she has been a proponent of joga nritya the ritual dance form performed by the jogapas a community of transgender people in north karnataka patiala based phulkari artist lejwanti was honored with padma shri award this year phulkari is the folk embroidery in punjab haryana area and mostly based on floral work in cotton fabric phulkari received the gi tag in 2011 ruben mashangwa a folk musician from manipur was awarded padma shri in 2021 he is known for reviving the musical tradition of the tankul naga of manipur who are a major ethnic group living in the indo burma border area buri bai a folk painter from bill tribal community of madhya pradesh was awarded padma shri this year she is well known for popularizing pithora art in india pithora paintings are folk art culture of gujarat done on walls by several tribes such as ratwas and bilalas characterized by the use of hoish motifs so that's a major current affairs from award section now let's test ourselves with an mcq dulari devi a folk painting artist from bihar was awarded padma shri for her contribution in which folk painting option a manjusha painting option b patwa art option c mithila art option d varli painting you can comment your answers in the comment box below short term courses long term courses short term courses include crash batches and foundation batch and long term courses include regular batches repeater batches and long term weekend batches for more details regarding our courses visit our website www.thinkthis.com the link will be provided in the description box below let's design your career let's design it together with think institute of design don't forget to like share subscribe and also click the bell icon bye stay tuned for more updates